Is that not a thing of beauty? If you guys are AK guys, you know what that is. It's a Russian Bakelite magazine. Some of the most loved and revered magazines in the AK world, whether you're talking about a 7.62 by 39 or a 545 by 39 variant, you have to have a Bakelite. So if you don't, I'm going to show you guys what's what here. There's that beautiful grain, the beautiful pattern. Looks like wood almost. Happens like that because of the process of mixing the materials. There's the star. Base plate is metal. You've got 75. You've got your hole, your little ridge. This is steel. I do believe. I could be wrong though. No, it's definitely steel. Oh. Doesn't that sound good? They are steel reinforced on the inside. Let's see if I can show you that. On the feed lips. And uh, they're gorgeous. Got a lot of history collectible there's all types of different patterns and swirls and stuff in the material they're just awesome and they work really good too the thing is is they definitely cost a pretty penny I paid 55 bucks for this mag and depending on who you are and what you think about that you know that sounds a little high 55 bucks for one just regular old magazine yeah, but I've seen them go for $75 or $100 on some websites, forums, you know, gun brokers, stuff like that. The price goes up and down, but because things are banned from import from Russia, I mean, there's limited quantity available. And I had to have one. I'm a big AK guy. I love AK-47, 74 is all the variants. And uh, I didn't have a Bakelite, but now I do. And it's sexy. It looks good in any AK rifle you put it in, no matter what color the rifle is. It's a classic design. It stands out. And they work really, really well. They're some of the most proven mags out there. Bakelite, if you don't know, is like a predecessor to plastic and polymer and stuff like that. Um, it's, it's just different. And uh, I'm really digging it, guys. Hope you are, too. Thanks for watching. Check the links in the description box below. Leave any comments down below. You know, if you guys know a spot to get these at a good price, let me know if you guys have any, have any experience with them, if you like AKs or not. And uh, we'll catch you on the next one, guys. Peace.